The first thing to look at if we're being late all the time is our footwork and our positioning. We need to read the ball as early as we can and then it's up to our feet to get us into position. See a lot of players that on a deep hard ball will stand in one place and try and play the ball as it's coming in and not maybe taking a quick step back so I have a little bit more time to play it in front of me. I might even come right back to where I was but I'm able to keep the ball in front rather than playing a ball taking my own time away. The second thing is if I'm getting my feet in pretty good position is obviously the preparation with my racket and this is the thing we're usually focused on is you know we either take too big of a swing and we're catching the ball late which is just too big for the ball coming or we just prepare even if we've got a small swing we're preparing late I do that awfully well don't I to where I'm now I'm late back here the third thing that's a, that's a little bit more detail is, is many players don't get their hand and wrist position set up early enough. They're, they're this way and I see a lot of club players where, where they take the racket back like this and now this is the position I have to hit the ball to get it into the court and they wonder why they're always hitting the ball behind them. So if my wrist position is set back here and I can keep that through to the contact point I'm going to be able to get the ball in front and hit it and hit the ball where I'm aiming. If my wrist is set this way, I'm almost forced to hit the ball late. 